So as car owners, we can't run away from the fact that once a year, every year, we need to renew the insurance of our cars. And the question, of course, that always comes up is, how much is our car insurance this year? The good news is there are plenty of websites in the internet. You just go Google search car insurance calculator Malaysia. There are a few of them which will allow you to just key in your engine capacity, where you stay, and also how much you want to insure your car for, and they will give you a rough estimate of how much your insurance premium is. But have you ever wondered how do the insurance companies actually calculate your insurance premium? So in today's video, which features material learned from the website comparehero.my, I've included a link to the original article in the description section below. I'm just going to explain that to you and also I will share with you a quick secret how you can use a bit of simple mental arithmetic to roughly gauge or estimate your insurance premium for your car this year. The first thing you need to do is to calculate how much is your gross premium and that is determined by three factors. One, your insured value. So basically if you insure a car at 50,000 versus 100,000, definitely at 100,000, you will pay a higher gross premium. That's one. Second thing is, it depends on where you stay, where you are using the car. So a car that is insured for Peninsula Malaysia will cost more versus a car that is being insured for East Malaysia. And don't try to be funny. JPJ is smarter than you if you try to run around in Peninsula Malaysia with a car using East Malaysia road tax, you will eventually get into trouble. And what's worse, if you need to make a claim and your East Malaysia insured car is in Peninsula Malaysia, chances are you will run into problems. And of course, the last determining factor is your engine capacity. This is the formula which the insurance companies use to calculate your gross premium. This figure here, this is a constant and this is determined by the size of your engine. So for example, if you're driving a car with a 1.5 liter engine, it starts at 305 ringgit 50 cents, whereas a three liter car starts at 372 ringgit and 60 cents. This is the base value determined by your engine capacity regardless of your car's insured value. Now, whatever this number is, then after that, you take your insured value minus a thousand ringgit and multiply it by 2.6%. Add this together and you arrive at your gross premium. So for example, if I'm insuring a three liter car at 100,000 ringgit insured value, what I will be dealing with is, this would be three, 372 ringgit 60 cents, 2.6% of 99,000 ringgit, that gives me 2,574, all right? And you add this together up, what you will arrive at the final figure of 2,946 ringgit and 60 cents all right that's it so this is the formula for peninsula malaysia in east malaysia the same formula applies but with smaller numbers so a 1.5 liter car in east malaysia for example starts off with a base rate of 220 ringgit a three liter car starts off with a base rate of 266 ringgit not only that instead of 2.6 percent this number now becomes 2.03%. It's still this base value plus 2.3% of the insured value minus a thousand ringgit. So let's say if you're insuring now a 100,000 ringgit three liter car in East Malaysia, your calculation therefore will be 266 ringgit 50 cents plus 2.03 percent of 99,000 ringgit which is 2,000 
and nine ringgit, 70 cents, right? That brings you to 2,275 ringgit, which is, well, significantly less compared to that of Peninsula Malaysia. So this is the formula which the insurance companies use to calculate your insurance premiums. Now, of course, if you want to do quick mental arithmetic, if you are staying in Peninsula Malaysia, just take your insured value, multiply by 3% to get a rough estimate. Or if you are in East Malaysia, multiply by 2%, you will get a rough estimate as well. So the calculations that I showed you earlier bring us to the gross premium. You subtract your NCD. These are your add-ons, which I will cover in the next video. But to arrive at the final figure, what you need to do is you need to take gross premium minus NCD, put in all your add-ons, and then you add your 10% SST to this total, and then you also plus a 10 ringgit stamp duty as well. Once you get all that, you arrive at the final figure which you need to pay your insurance company. And of course, if you are a regular Horizon viewer, you will be familiar with Evo Club car insurance. And I'm just going to do a quick refresh on how Evo Club car insurance work. So you always say you get to save up to 40% of your car insurance, but where does that 40% come in? Well, it's actually here, all right, this part where your gross premium, subtract your NCD, this is where the 40% savings apply. And as a reminder, when you say 40%, 5,000 kilometers, what we mean by that is that you still get comprehensive insurance coverage for the first 5,000 kilometers. And once you hit 5,000 kilometers, you have two options. One, you can either top up to the next plan, all right, the 10,000 kilometer plan or the 15,000 kilometer plan or unlimited mileage plan by just paying the difference and not a cent more. Or you can choose to not top up and continue driving without comprehensive insurance, but you still enjoy the minimum insurance coverage that is needed to keep your car road legal. So if you want to enjoy these savings for yourself, I've included a link in the description section below or you can contact our team if you require further assistance. So I hope you found this video useful. Uh, give it a like, share with me your thoughts in the comment section and do subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so. And of course, hit the notification bell to make sure that you're aware the next time I upload a new video. Remember, I will be talking about add-ons. What are the add-ons that you will want to consider the next time you renew? your car insurance, and how much do these add-ons cost? Of course, do also contact the Evo Club Car Wash team if you have car wash, car care, car detailing needs, or if you want to find out our latest promos and packages. So until my next video, take care, stay safe. I'll see you soon.